Hi, it's Lori Larson, and today I want to show you how you add or change the music on your Animoto video. There's a couple of other um, hints and tricks that go along with this. It's a seemingly simple thing to do, but uh, it can get complicated. So when you pick your style out, it comes automatically with a song. And uh, a couple of things to pay attention to over here. The first number that you see is how long your video is based on the number of pictures that you have. In general, about 24 pictures equals a minute or 12 pictures per 30 seconds. The second number is how long the song is. Ideally, uh, you would like these two things to match up, but if you don't have that many pictures and um, your song is kind of long, three or four minutes, the song will just fade out. So you don't necessarily have to worry about it. You actually have to worry about it more when you have too many pictures and the song is not long enough. So let's take a look at how you would change the music. Uh, first, you just need to click this and it pops open the window for changing the music. You can upload a song if you want to. Uh, I'm just going to go to the sample music here. When you are uploading a song, you need to make sure that it's an MP3 file. Uh, that's the one that works with Animoto. If you're using the mobile app, either for an Android or iOS uh, device, then you can upload music from your device. But when you're working on a computer, it needs to be an MP3 file. It takes a minute or two for the music to get put onto the application and uh, then it's processed. So now you can see the song is a different title. If for some reason your mp3 didn't transfer the information you would see an editing pencil kind of like this right here and you could add the song name and the artist right there. Maybe you don't have your own song that you want to use and you want to use Animoto's. Uh, they have a great selection here. I like to sort it by genre so I can check out if it's classical music, uh, you can't hear the different music in this recording. However, all you need to do is click this play button right here and it will give you a preview of the song. Uh, so there's lots of different kinds of music, classical, country, electronica, gospel and Christian, Halloween if you're really scary, uh, hip hop, Holiday, which is a nice way of saying Christmassy kind of music in general. House, which sounds like disco music. Indie rock, that's going to fall into the coffee shop category. Instrumental is all different kinds of music, but there's no words to it. Jazz, sounds like jazz. Latin could be more uh, South American kind of Latin, could be more music from Mexico kind of Latin, or it could sound more Spanish as in European Spain. Uh, New Age sort of sounds like a spa. Oldies sound like your great grandparents. Pop sounds like pop music, something that you would hear on the radio now. Romantic, uh, lots of love songs there, but different kinds of sounding romantic songs. Singer and songwriter, again, sounds like a coffee shop with a lot of emphasis on guitar or piano. And you can also sort it by length. So if you know you have a lot of pictures and you want something long, you can find something down here in the nine minute category. Uh, most of the artists here, the music sounds really nice, but it's probably nothing that you're going to hear on the radio or popular. It's uh, a lot of people that are just starting off and trying to get their music heard. So once you pick a song, um, you can settle on that. And just click Add Song, and it changes that. Finally, the last thing I want to show you here is a few secrets in this gear tab. Uh, you can trim a song, so you can shorten up the song at the beginning and you would just play it right there to see where exactly to begin and end it. You can also do that at the end, but like I said, the song will also fade out if you don't have enough pictures. You can make your pictures go faster through the image pacing thing right here, or you can slow them down so people can appreciate them a little bit longer. When I have a lot of pictures, and especially if I'm trying to fit them into the song, I will often take it off the manual image pacing and let Animoto do all the work for me. Um, once I have figured that out, 
I will click Save and then I will begin to add my pictures.